Hello everyone. Um, I wanted to share my thoughts about the recent um, changes uh, that the California Association of Realtors put out stating that real estate is now an essential industry. Um, obviously, I got um, I have mixed emotions about that because as much as we want to go out there and, and, and put deals together and open escrows and show properties, we still have to take the necessary precautions. And what do I mean by that? Um, at the end of the day, yeah, I want to be essential to my clients and I want to be essential to my agents, but I want to be more essential to my family, my loved ones. I want to be able to come home knowing that I'm not going to put them at risk because I touched the doorknob or I shook hands with somebody that a month or two ago uh, was in contact with somebody that that's now in ICU because of coronavirus. So um, just because we were uh, part of that essential list of uh, industries, it doesn't mean that we're off limits. Uh, I know that a lot of realtors that are not keeping up with the news and are not reading the changes and, and recent guidelines are probably going to go out there without the necessary precautions. They're going to think, well, this can't happen to me. I'm going to go out there and I'm going to host an open house. I recently saw somebody uh, this week host open houses. And I'm thinking, again, we all want to put escrows on the board. However, I'm not going to do it at the risk of my clients. I'm not going to do it at the risk of my agents. And I'm certainly not going to do it at the risk of my loved ones. Uh, so please, just because we were mentioned as, a, as an essential in the industry, it doesn't mean that we got to go about our business the way we were doing it four or five months ago. We still have to uh, realize that we don't know who visited that, that vacant open house. We don't know if that buyer that you are, you know, showing properties to didn't meet with somebody a month or two ago that might be infected and they don't even know it. So um, I know that we're all going crazy with this quarantine, but at the end of the day, I'd rather be quarantined because I don't have anything than be quarantined because I have something. So um, again, we're, we're all battling these uncertainties and, 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 and the fear of how long is this gonna last now knowing that the um, the quarantine is probably going to last uh, probably till end of April. I mean, at the end of the day, we can complain or we can adjust the way we are running our lives, we're living our lives, um, or we can complain and, and do nothing and it's just going to make everything worse. So uh, as much as I want to sell hundreds of houses a, a year, I need to put my family uh, as the most important thing. I got to put my clients uh, as, as, as the most important thing and there's no reason to risk it. And I'm sure brokers out there uh, like myself, we're trying to figure out how to still conduct business. Uh, but let's not do it at the expense of somebody getting uh, infected. So I love you all. Let's stay safe. Let's practice the social distancing, even though we're, we're hating it. I know we feel like we need to talk to somebody. We're, we're going crazy because we're not having conversations. We don't go to that restaurant. We're not hanging out with family. Uh, but again, the longer this goes, the longer this will drag. So let's just uh, stay put, stay positive, and um, whatever your religious beliefs are, I believe that there's a higher power and this is going to pass. It'll pass sooner than we think, but we got to do, do what's right. I love you all.